I think many of us are too accustomed to thinking of a concussion is uh, not too much of a big deal. But in fact, it is a brain injury because uh, when someone has a concussion and they have symptoms of a concussion from memory loss, being blacked out or whatever, those symptoms are caused by uh, damage to brain cells. And brain cells are damaged when uh, someone either falls and hits their head and uh, the brain smashes against the skull, or even when someone doesn't hit their head but their, their uh, skull is jolted forward and backward, sort of a whiplash type action. Um, and it's that crashing of the skull within, of the brain within the skull that causes the damage to the cells in the area where contact is made. Sometimes uh, these cells are damaged by the shearing forces of the brain rotating within the skull and it tears and shears these uh, neurons or brain cells as well. But by definition, if you have a concussion, you've had a brain injury. And it's very important not to minimize uh, the effects or the potential long-lasting consequences of a concussion. You need to see a doctor, get it evaluated properly. Um, the odds are that people will recover with a concussion, but many don't, and it's important to have it diagnosed early.